Afri Forum have vowed that they will be opening a criminal case against e EFF. So there's going to be a criminal case. However, the questions rem or the question remains unanswered as to we though there are criminal case or there's a criminal case against uh, Palapala, but there is nothing that has ever happened to Palapala. So maybe we need to understand that who gets arrested and who doesn't get arrested. I mean, just to give you a bit of context, it is the very same. Uh, it is the very same uh, FF Plus that opened a case against Julius Malema. Uh, when there was, do you remember that the that 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 thing, uh, pa 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 during e, 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 look, EFF rally? It is this same. Oh, the reason why you see Julius Malema in court, it is the very same FF plus that opened a case against Julius Malema. So they've done it again. They have already confirmed officially so that soon they will be laying criminal charges against EFF, against Abo Floyd Chivambo, against Abo, uh, against Abo Julius Malema. Funny enough, there are ANC members that are involved in that, and we're not hearing about them. One of the persons that is involved in this very same uh, VPS uh, heist, as they call it, there it is a member of the ANC. But funny enough, it has been uh, even in the media. It has been the um, it has been an EFF thing instead of being uh, about everybody that participated in that process. That is why I said to you guys, I've got a very, 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 very serious problem about how they are pursuing this. It's like uh, it's okay for them to uh, look. It's like. Uh, it's like they are very happy to see EFF suffering the consequences, you know, uh, being made to look like you are the horrible guys. You know what I'm saying? You are the bad guys. But like I said, the ANC members, uh, I've, got it, I've got it here, who are implicated in this thing. Like I said, one of them is from Limpombo. Nothing is being said about that. So there is this... There's this vigorous approach to this that we need to get these guys of EFF arrested. And it's, that is exactly what we are saying. We will make sure that we get them arrested, all of them. And that is exactly what they are currently doing. So we're going to go through this article together. Uh, I will show you the look what they are currently saying. But before I can show you that, you also need to do this if you are not yet subscribed what are you waiting for come on good people because to subscribe it is free to like the video it is free to comment in the comment section below it is free of charge to click the notification bell it is free of charge to share this video it is free of charge to watch this video until the end it is free of charge also good people i mean come on to watch the ads it's free of charge and that's how you financially contribute to this YouTube channel. Speaking about financial contribution to the channel, you can join, become a member of this YouTube channel from as little as 20 rand a month. You can also uh, use the super thanks party. In case you don't want to do that, guys, there is a way where you can use my media company banking details to donate to the channel. And you know what I'm saying? We'll bring you more. And also, guys, want to buy more equipment so the power is in your hands please do the honorable thing as we proceed okay so uh here, here is what I, I i find it interesting right let's read this article let's read this article right afri forum uh, to lay a criminal complaint against eff leaders so a criminal co complaint is just basically it can be translated um, criminal case. So write a VPS bank heist after forum to lay criminal complaint against EFF leaders. This they confirmed on Tuesday, 16 June 2024 at about 11 a.m. So it has been one hour uh, before I could confirm it to you. It says... 
Afriforum says it will lay criminal complaint against Julius Malema and Floyd Shivambo. Um, it accuses the EFF leader, leaders for corruption, fraud, and money laundering. It came after they were named in a leaked affidavit by former VPS bank chair, Chifua Matonzi. Uh, Matonzi pleaded guilty to 33 charges and that was it was sentenced to 15 years in jail so uh, i've been asking these questions it's just that i'm not getting the answers i've been asking these questions and i'm going to ask you these questions and I'll, I'll keep asking you again why is it that vps is made to be an eff thing whereas you see, guys, media is very dangerous. Media is very dangerous. But let's read here. They said, we be, look, they said, what, will, what, will, uh, what we want is the hawks to do, uh, to do is to follow the money, said Afro Forum CEO. We believe that there is enough indication to make a prima facie case of corruption, money laundering, money laundering against Mr. Shivambu and uh, o Julius Silo Malema. Okay, I've said quite a lot about that and I don't want us to dwell much on this, but my closing remarks on this matter is just as simple as this one. What oh, oh, oh. I'm concerned about this constant narrative. Maybe, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know. Should we say the EFF Nabo, it's a karma? I don't know. Should we call it a karma? You know why I'm saying that? It's because, they, if I'm not mistaken, they were the ones who were very much who were very much loud about VPS and uh, Jacob Zuma, VPS, Jacob Zuma, VPS, Jacob Zuma, VPS. And maybe had they not been loud, this would not have been a, a case. I don't know. Had they not attacked Zuma, maybe the VPS scandal wouldn't have been... Uh, wouldn't have gotten the wouldn't have gotten the hype that it gotten. It wouldn't have been... It wouldn't, it wouldn't have become a big deal. By the way, what I also don't understand is that we need to go back now and check Ugu Toke because there, there, there was public scrutiny about the loan that they gave Jacob Zuma, right? Um, Jacob Zuma needed to pay back the money, uh, about seven something million. So he got a loan from EVPS. My question to you is, if that is the case, Jacob Zuma got a loan and what was irregular about it? I think that is something as well that I need to go back and check. What, 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 what is it that they were complaining about back in the days that was irregular concerning Jacob Zuma receiving this, uh, receiving this, um, receiving the money that Jacob Zuma received now? But again, uh, what, what, what is of interest is the fact that this, this guy... Uh, Julius Malema and uh, uh, this guy, Julius Malema and uh, Floyd Chivambo. Um, in fact, let's start with Julius Malema. Julius Malema, uh, right now, he had recently been in court for that. Uh, for, for Not for that, but for... Um, what is this case? The, it's related to firearm that was fired during an event, an EFF. Uh, the instigator or the, mastermind, the people who masterminded that, it is none other than Afri Forum themselves. So we see this political strategy where they're using the law to destroy other people. And that is something that I think it is becoming very, very, very dangerous. You, you might think they are doing uh, the Lord's work, but it's not good to see people fighting other people, but using the law. Why I'm saying that is because that if you think that this Afri Forum, really they they are concerned about the keeping of the law, then you must also ask yourself the following question. 
What are they doing about Palapala? If really they are concerned about the keeping of the law, what are they doing about Palapala? Two, you must ask yourself the following question. There was a man that was found of local, to, the man that was found to have said very hateful speech about kill the black people, about all oh, oh, What have they done about it? Just to demonstrate to you that if it was about the law, then the law doesn't know any culture, gender, uh, color, and anything. The law knows nobody. You break the law, you must account. So if it is about the law, it's not a political thing, then why are they not dealing with those people? As I